100 gold. For those two, 200 gold. Each? Okay. <laughs> Deal. So the priest goes about his rituals. Yeah, I'm half breeds. <clears throat> and, uh. Take 200 gold off yours. <laughs> I'm not paying for you. Come on. <laughs> That's fine. While, while you. While they're getting their magical healing going on, uh, the head priest, you know, says, kind of explains that the council is in desperate need of assistance, and, you know, the, the temple has been called upon to offer whatever assistance it can, uh, and, you know, being of the faith, yes, yes, would be like, you know, would be helpful to go to the council house. Uh, I was to say, I, I was about to offer our services as this is a cleric to help here, but if you, if you feel it is more necessary to help the console, we'll do that. Kevin, I'm going to grab my remaining 80 gold from you. Okay. You want me to still carry your silver? Yes. Ross! I'm going to take some notes. So. Yeah, wealth exchange would probably be a good thing to think Money about. Money changer! To stabilize the economy, tell you, I'm going to do that with a huge support city. Yeah. Okay. Oh, thanks for healing me. Basically, uh, <laughs> <Stop out. laughs> dip on out as fast as you can. In your uh, your bribery of the the beggar on the corner, um, there's. Lots and lots and lots of uh, refugees coming from the west. What you should do is get your gold fling the war. So it's um, easier for you to carry. The shipyards are really busy. Well, yeah. you get them up pretty uh, There are ships in and out of the harbor. See how much the gems are worth. But getting out of the city is expensive currently. Um, yeah, but it's not gonna be by via water? Via water. Getting, getting passage on a ship is expensive. Um, you build these gems as currency. Basically, all the prices are jacked up right now because the economy has been kind of thrown out of line. They don't obviously say it as eloquently, but... Uh, however, if you do want to have a good time and you've got some gold, there's a little bar to the east of the city, outside of the city walls, in the fishing port. It's a uh, it's a pretty tight run place, but he strongly recommends the ale there is magnificent. That's all. Oh, fuck, Jorgendal's gonna go here. <laughs> That's all Jorgendal's gonna hear. He, he just perks up. Uh, Can I possibly have the name of this fine this paper, the fine establishment's owner, or someone who I might be able to in contact with? It's called the tavern is called. The Rusty Hammer Tavern. The Rusty Hammer. This is the Rusty Trombone. The gem weight is. It's run by a mage named Telus. You can just hand me those gems. Tell us about them, Tell us. What race is Telus? Human. Huh? Who is this human? I'm gonna go with Jordan Doll. Drink it. Uh, uh, I'm gonna write off the bat, but wherever you go, there I'm going. I'm, after our, our well, temple well, thing, still going. Uh, I want to search for gym. a place where I can get this direwolf pelt made into two cloaks that I am Ooh. still carrying. <laughs> <laughs> you now have a direwolf pelt cloak. Uh, the flaming corset. Uh, thanks. But I get the magical. magical. That's more magic. Okay. So what I have a that? fine robe and dress, I believe. Mm -hmm. Whoa. And a bolt of fine gold. I saw that. Unless they're magical. In which case, okay. That's cool. You're going to spend a similar amount of time just for the sake of making it all even. Uh, and then you can <coughs> identify it with them. So you I'm have the bolt of cloth. Yep. We're going to try uh, and identify the weapon. Yeah. It's pretty impressed with it. Values it at about 400 gold pieces. Oh, oh, I should have did that at the temple. What? I'll go back to the temple. Forgot to have them look at my sword to see if they have any ideas. <laughs> you just go. No ideas? You're fetching this belt. Or this pelt. 
And then, oh wait, I forgot something. <laughs> hey what guys, co- what, what color check is this it? out. Just give me something so I can have a blue. Blue? Okay, I'm gonna fashion Watch what happens when I hit something, there's a red one. Right from flash. Afar. Uh, what's the opposite no, direction? what happens is nothing at all. <laughs> far east? <laughs> the far east is <laughs> evil. Okay, kill us, sick guy. The far east. My powder power just goes away. You're not gonna find, you might be finding Damn it. cloth of oh, I was working their quality, really but you're not gonna find any of this. And I rolled a 22 on my persuasion. Or bluff. The same. He goes into the back room and brings out a bolt of the exact same cloth. <laughs> 400 it is. <laughs> uh, what does he think of the dresses and the... Uh, the They're broke. The given, given the demand, he's willing to up the price on the dress. And that's 30 gold, okay. which is... Pretty lean. You would know that that's, 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 a, that's a good nice penny for yep. a dress. Uh, and he's looking at the robe, and he's looking at the gems on it, and he's very, very impressed with it. Uh, and he probably doesn't have a dollars and cents in, in the store to purchase it. He says, it's going to be straight with you. It's worth about 1,200 gold. Damn. Is it fanciful or is it magical? Not magical. Oh. Just all but it's the gems magical. inlaid. The gems inlaid in it is what are very it valuable. I thank him for his uh, honesty, and I give him uh, an extra ten gold, or just say, well, he'll net ten gold let's, from me. Let's see what the bolt of silk silk is worth. So thirty gold from that, thirty gold from the dress, <laughs> and four hundred gold. Four hundred sixty gold. Four hundred sixty plus an extra ten, so. Four hundred seventy gold, and or you I, know that the robe is worth twelve hundred bucks. Well, I'm sorry. 450 gold in your yeah, pocket. Yeah. So, 510. Guy, did you go with these guys to get a... No. He left. He left yeah, us. You went, you went about your business? Yeah. He went, fuck you. I went to go about my business. Thanks for the advice. <laughs> Didn't want to die. You wouldn't die. you just become a wear rat. You'd be fine. Yeah, I don't think he wants to do that either. He'll be fine. He gets DR. It's true. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, what else are you up to? I'm going to find a place to get rid of that armor. The uh, plus one leather? Yeah. You can sell it same place. Cool. Mm-hmm. Too bad uh, guy wasn't there. That would have been nice for him. Yeah. Plus yeah. one leather armor would be amazing armor for guy. He's off uh, baiting somewhere, so. Mm-hmm. No, because he doesn't have any money. Oh, that's right. <laughs> All his money is with Kevin. Did, uh, they'll give you 800 gold for the armor. But did Napoleon, uh, Nap- Napoleon Bonaparte money. put his armies Where? in his sleeveys? Where did he put his armies? He put his armies in his in sleeves. sleeves. Mm. Oh my god. <laughs> Mark! <laughs> Oh, I cracked up so hard when I read that earlier. <laughs> I bet you did. What are your characters doing? You had a meal. What else are you doing? Uh, what was my set of leather? Anything magical? Ooh, what are those? Did I realize, like, did it, did it feel tingly when I put it on? Nobody <laughs> detected magic on anything, so I couldn't tell you if it's magical or not. Okay. Uh, Tell you one thing, you're full of lice and fleas. And- <laughs> <laughs> it's not tingly, it is a little itchy. <laughs> I will go and try to discover where these, some of the, anybody else is. I'm sure you didn't disinfect that. My fun, next plan was to go uh, find these two. I'm on my way to a magic shop. Mark, while stumbling around, you bump into a robot. Hey, robot. Great. I, want, I, heard, I heard there's a quest of the consulate. Give me your money. <laughs> Screw you. I'm Give, the robot. Is this your rogue or your cleric? Both of them. Give me your money. <laughs> I can take them. I can take them. <laughs> I need it for important right, things. So four hours have passed. <laughs> what time is it now in the day? Midday. Two ish. Okay, 2.57. Heading to the magic shop. Where are we going next? 
Jorgen will and I. I'm assuming I bump into the consular consulate. Uh, do you want to stop in a magic shop? shop? You go, well, who want what? Actually, I like a magic shop. Who's that? A magic shop, yeah. Yeah, a magic shop, yeah. Definitely. Yeah, you find him. Hey! You gotta think that you can only go so far. I'm on a magic shop. I got a bunch of shit to identify. Yeah, we're gonna go to the magic shop too to see if they can look at my sword. Can I get my animal companion yet? In the city? Yeah, you can yeah. get some rats. You can go. <laughs> we'll let you go outside the walls and find your animal companion. Find the squab. Squab. My animal companion. Pidgey. Pidgeotto. <laughs> hundred fifty gold an item. Persuade down, perhaps. Nineteen. I've got other customers. Okay. <laughs> Worth a shot. <laughs> got a Hagel. No, I get it. I get it. Uh, first off is going to be the ring. Shitty move. That's not bad. Ring of protection plus one. Was decent. Ooh. Ooh, you first one. It. First one was all right. First one was pretty good. Second one. When they broke out of the... Black of the pearl. Wait, is it black pearl? That's not magic. Okay. Yeah, that was good. Oh, I do have this... The second one. I have two Game swords to identify. Uh, oh. Do I know what the, the little kid that was in the attic? That would suck. That's, do I know what that is, is now, is roughly? That I can if you pay 150, you'll know exactly what it is. Will, it, will they tell me how to deactivate it and give it to someone else? The ring to. Or is uh, it, they could try to just see if it's possible. Is it attuned to me now? The deer freak out. Well, that's something you could discover for 150 gold pieces. Uh, 150 gold pieces. Uh, interestingly enough, it's a cursed item. Oh, really? But it's giving you the benefit. It is giving you the benefit. But you can't get rid of it. Oh, so that's the curse. It's always there. Okay. All right. And, then and if you try to grab it, it moves away. Uh, <laughs> let's see what Jorgenal has anything on him. I just got those potions. Throw a blanket over his head. Spending 150. Maybe it's all right. Okay, it's not racist. Yeah. I get it. Long Do you? Yeah. Sword ET68. Is that the one I was using? I don't know. It was some yeah, transmitter on the thing. The con during the happening. I believe the, it, yeah, I don't think that was magical, but it was. Yeah, it was. It was happening. It was not that good. knows what I'm doing. I'm going to get this glowing scimitar that I got off the the pedestal. Identified? No, I haven't seen that either. Ooh. Patrick Wilson. Do you remember what the yeah, number it was? Uh, no, you just told me oh, glowing scimitar. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm like sorry. The ring okay. one where it's they, not your fault. They go to the house and. It's 150, you said? Yep. It's okay. Or wait, no. You're talking about. It's a scimitar. A no flaming there blast okay. burst. It's something like super awesome. <laughs> <Yeah. though. laughs> Why haven't we been using that? For that? <laughs> I like the city. I forgot it, to be honest. It's got all the he elements. He did too until just now. Well, if it's Holy if it's really fire, good, maybe I'll just thunder. keep it and then spec into dual wielding the Ooh. paladin. Burr, 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 burr. <laughs> I'm gonna go get. Burr, 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 burr. <laughs> it's painful. 